Hi everyone, this is uh, Dr. Ethi. Now today we are going to explain this uh, problem. This is the example problem of the complex number. Mm, okay, oh, T more against law. Uh, in this example, uh, first of all, uh, here mm, we are going to choose uh, in this given problem uh, 1 plus uh, sin pi by 8, 1 plus sin pi by 8 plus uh, i cos uh, pi by 8 by 1 plus uh, sin pi by 8 minus uh, i cos pi by 8. Okay, in this problem. Only we are going to choose this. Uh, why? Because uh, uh, find out the value of uh, here minus 1. Okay. Uh, first of all, uh, here um, in place of sin 5 by 8, right? Cos of 90 minus theta. We know that the formula sin theta equals to cos of uh, 90 minus uh, theta. Here theta means 5 by 8. So, 5 by 2 minus 5 by 8 plus i cos of uh, 5 by 2 minus 5 by 8. Okay. Oh, next of all. Sorry. Here. I sign of. Next that. Denominator also. 1 plus cos of 5 by 2 minus 5 by 8. Minus I sign of 5 by 2 minus 5 by 8. Okay. Oh. We know that the formula is sin theta equals to cos 90 minus theta. Cos theta equals to sin 90 minus theta. This is the sin. Sin 90 minus theta. Denominator also same formula is here. Uh, we are going to applying here. Okay. Oh, next of all right. Here we know that 1 plus cos 5 by 2 minus 5 by 8. 5 by 2 minus 5 by 8 means, uh, LC means here 8 cos of uh, 2 4 or 8. 4 pi minus pi means uh, 3 pi by 8 plus uh, I sin of uh, here also 3 pi by 8 by 1 plus uh, cos of uh, 3 pi by 8 minus uh, I sin of uh, 3 pi by 8. Okay, we know that the formula here 1 plus cos theta equals to 2 cos square theta by 2 and sin theta equals to 2 sin theta by 2, 2 sin theta by 2, cos theta by 2. Here, in place of 1 plus cos theta, both numerators and denominators applying the formula 2 cos square theta by 2. Here, right, 2 cos square theta by 2. 2 cos square theta by 2 means 3 pi by 16. Plus, here, uh, I sin 3 pi by 8 means 2 sin 3 pi by 16 into cos 3 pi by 16. Denominator also, here, 2 cos square 3 pi by 16 minus here i into sorry i into here also i into 2 sin 3 pi by 16 into cos 3 pi by 16 both numerators and denominators here cos 3 pi by 16 means common now cos 2 cos 3 pi by 16, sorry, 2 cos 3 pi by 16 means common here both numerators and denominators. Remaining cos 3 pi by 16 minus i sin 3 pi by 16 is the numerator, sorry, this is plus. Denominator also 2 cos 3 pi by 16 into cos 3 pi by 16 minus i sin 3 pi by 16 i sin 3 pi by 16 here um, both are cancel here cos 3 pi by 16 plus i sin 3 pi by 16 uh, that is, is 3 pi by 16 uh, this is, is 
minus of 3 pi by 16. Okay, or cos theta plus i sin theta or cis theta. Here also applying cis theta, but minus is there. Right, cis of minus 3 pi by 16. We know that the formula again cis alpha by cis beta is cis of alpha plus beta. Cis of 3 pi by 16. Mm, here, uh, minus, sorry, cis alpha by cis beta equals to cis alpha minus cis beta. Uh, here, minus is there. So, plus 3 pi by 16. This is, says, 6 pi by 16. 2 threes, 2 eights. Uh, this is, cis 3 pi by 8. Cis 3 pi by 8. Eight. Okay, or now here we are going to take 1 plus sine of 3 pi by 8 plus i cos of 3 pi by 8 by 1 plus sine of 3 pi by 8 minus i cos of 3 pi by 8 whole power 8 by 3 equals to uh, cis 3 pi by 8 whole power 8 by 3. Cis 3 pi by 8. Here write cis 3 pi by 8 whole power whole power 8 by 3. Whole power 8 by 3. Here only uh, this will get answer means cis 3 pi by 8. Whole power 8 by 3 means cis 3 pi by 8 whole power 8 by 3. Now your cis uh, 3 8s are 24. 24 pi by 24. 24 24 gets cancelled. Cis pi means uh, minus 1. Hence, uh, show that the given expression 1 plus sin pi by 8 plus i cos pi by 8 by 1 plus sin pi by 8 minus i cos pi by 8 whole power 8 by 3 equals to minus 1. So, cis pi equals to minus 1. Uh, here, cis pi means uh, sin pi plus i cos pi. Uh, here, sorry, cos pi plus i sin pi. Uh, sin pi means 0, cos pi means pi minus 1. So, here cis pi also minus 1. Okay, uh, thank you.